Carly Vauder is well aware of the struggles of childhood cancer patients and their families. Like it never ends and that their whole life they're going to have to continue to go to doctor's appointments and fight through different struggles that, that childhood cancer and treatments will bring to them. A cancer survivor herself, she felt the call to help others, so she started making and selling beaded bracelets. Since 2017, I made the first donation with $75, and then this year I put it on Instagram and started Instagram and Facebook. That's when her sales took off. In the last two years, aided by the extra time at home the pandemic afforded her. In 2020, I made 300 during quarantine. She was able to raise $625 to be used for families on the cancer hall at Brenner Children's Hospital. Her Instagram and Facebook pages are full of stories of children and their fight against cancer. When you're making the bracelets, all you're thinking about is like what you're doing it for and the children and you really do like fall in love with the children even though you're like never met them and share like it's like their family even through like a screen. It's a trait her assistant principal noticed in her early on. Carly just has a beautiful spirit uh, in meeting her. She was very quiet kind of to herself but she's always had this focus like you knew that Carly was about business, she knew what she was there for, and she, you know, wasn't going to let go of her goals. She says Carly's a great example of what their school stands for. In the curriculum embedded in what all our teachers do, there is this sense of citizenship and being aware of who other people are and how they're developing. So along with them learning their science, math, and, and core and elective courses, the sense that others need care and others need compassion and help is built in there. With her parents cheering her on every step of the way, Carly says she'll continue to make bracelets and raise funds because she wants to bring the families one thing. I'll hope to bring them hope. Like that hope is my main thing on my page and showing them that there is, that there is um, always hope no matter what their child's going through. Cindy Farmer, Fox 8 News.